Hello, my name is Joanna Swinton and I'm a designer for craftsyouprint.com. Today I'm going to show you how I do my three panel pop out card. These are the cards and this is the Mongolia lady and they sit really nice. And this is another one of my favourites. But I'm actually going to show you how to make this one, the lilac lilies. I love birds, you can usually tell I love birds. So I've done some pre-work so that we're not going to be boring you with things you've already seen. Okay, so when you get your pack, you'll have in it the two parts for the envelope and you'll also have um, a part that's got the back on, a part that's got pieces to go in here and also your decoupage. Now what I've also done is on your pack you will find two fronts. This is because somebody complained to me that my lines were very um, strong and it spoiled the card. So what I've started doing now, I've done one with the strong lines because not all of us can see brilliantly well. I'm not very good. And one with faint lines for those of us that want them a bit fainter. So the first thing we're going to do is the front section. I've already cut one of my lines across here. And we need to cut the other one. So the only two lines really that we are going to cut. Just get that in there. Okay. I'm very good at coming off the lines when I do this. So I'm going to actually make the front before we put the back section on. So we've got these bits. Now this is the way that I do it and it's entirely up to you how you do it but I find this the easiest way. First thing I do is put my ruler on the lines that I'm going to be folding and I just fold them all up for now just like that. And the same here. Same there. And on the other side. Just get them nicely lined up. Okay, that's lovely. This first, this middle piece here, it's going to come out like that. And those bits are going to the back. So we need to just fold that, fold that. And the same on the other side. Make sure it's nicely lined up. Like that. Line it up on that side. And there we are. Right, I'm just going to use my bone folder now just to make those a little bit more definite. Right. Lovely. So now it looks like this. On the front we've got our decoupage piece. So decided that you probably all know how to do that so I've not bothered to uh, do it in bits save wasting time line it up nicely and the birdie's tail get the bits on Yep. There we are. 
You'll also find in the kit, in your decoupage section, a bit of a bird. Now what I tend to do with this bit is feather it. So that it gives it that little bit of feather look. So just get your scissors and just snip round the edges and up the tail section just to give it a bit of a feathered look. that section and it just adds a little bit extra to the card now then I'm going to do this last piece I usually use wet glue but I'm a bit pushed for time today we're off on holiday today with the grandchildren and the daughter and the son-in-law so I'm just using double-sided And just stick your other half onto that. Nicely line it up. There we go. Nicely lined up. And then to finish that off. We need to just bend that section over. And there we go. There's quite a few of the designs for this uh, card. I hope you like it. And I'll be back to show you something else very soon. All the best for summer that's coming. It's a lovely sunny day. And bye-bye.